On Wednesday, WTI crude futures slipped below $76 per barrel, hitting their lowest level since July 20. This decline was predominantly propelled by growing apprehensions regarding diminishing demand from two major consumers, China and the United States. These concerns were further compounded by lackluster performance in Chinese exports throughout October, casting doubts on global demand. Adding to the pessimism, a U.S. government report projected that per capita gasoline demand in America would reach a 20-year low in the coming year. The Energy Information Administration also revised their forecasts, now anticipating a 300,000-barrel-per-day decrease in total petroleum consumption in the United States for this year. This represents a significant shift from their earlier projection of a 100,000-barrel-per-day increase. On the supply side, U.S. crude inventories witnessed a substantial increase of nearly 12 million barrels last week, marking the most substantial surge since early 2023. Simultaneously, Russian oil shipments achieved a four-month high. Despite these challenging circumstances, it's noteworthy that both Saudi Arabia and Russia reaffirmed their commitment to maintain additional voluntary cuts in oil supply until the end of the year. In light of the current market conditions, the short-term outlook for oil prices appears pessimistic. The combination of increasing U.S. stockpiles, revised demand projections, and a stronger U.S. dollar creates a cautious stance for those optimistic about oil. Should WTI oil dip below the $76 support level, it is poised to move toward the subsequent support level at $74. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to support the channel if you enjoyed the video. See you in the next one.